Hi everyone, welcome to the RP Resonance Chemistry. Now let's continue with our lectures on electrochemistry. Today we are going to deal with uh, one of the application of EMF that is nothing but uh, solubility product. Solubility product, which is uh, simply denoted by the like a KESP. So this is the solubility product of the presentation. Okay, now let's go through the uh, the basic terminology, basic uh, concept of solubility product. Okay, now here, so we have the one glass of water. Okay, so three by fourth of uh, volume which is filled by the water okay it is let us assume here it is the uh, beaker so in the beaker three by fourth of a volume that is nothing but water is uh, filled okay so now let us add the like one spoon of the one spoon of the salt so here once uh, once it is a uh, stirred it is uh, it is dissolved okay now let us add the another spoon like that uh, like a seventh spoon eighth spoon a tenth spoon is added Okay, now the, uh, it is all, always up to 10th spoon, it is dissolved, completely dissolved. So now, however, the 11th spoon of salt is added to the particular solution. Now here, there is no dissolution. Now the precipitation takes place. Now onwards, here it is precipitated, started. Okay, so before the 11th spoon, up to, up to, like uh, below the 10th spoon, that means uh, up to 9th spoon, it is an unsaturated solution. Unsaturated solution. Okay, so now wherever the, when it is added by the just a small quantity of any salt which is added to the particular solution, then it turns to the like a precipitate formation. That position, that position is called the saturated position. Now here, so complete dissolution is observed. This is the saturated position, saturated solution. Okay, now here in case of uh, unsaturated solution, however, the addition amount of uh, salt which is the soluble in the which is dissolved in the particular solution. Now here it is completely saturated solution. That means uh, uh, if another another extent of solute which is added to which is added to the particular solution, then here the precipitation reaction takes place. Okay, so that type of reaction is nothing but a saturated solution. Now in the saturated solution, we add the some of the solute particle. We add the sum of the solute particle. Now here it is precipitation takes place. Now it 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 forms the like a precipitates. It forms the precipitates. Now let us take the simple example. So so here the solution is like a AgCl solution. Now again I add the another AgCl compound. AgCl compound. So now here in this case of solution of before the before the dilution uh, that means uh, before the precipitated mo uh, moles of solute added. Okay. Now here this these uh, all the, almost of the AgCl so AgCl which is dissolved into the particular solution which is dissolved into the particular solution. Those are appears as Ag plus and Cl minus. Okay. Now here whenever we will add the additional mole of solute then it becomes precipitated. Then it becomes precipitated okay now the dynamic equilibrium is observed those the solid crystal that means a crystalline AgCl and a dissolved ions of silver cation and chloride anion so that is called an equilibrium state now here it is a AgCl solid AgCl which is a dynamic equilibrium with a Ag plus and Cl minus Ag plus and Cl minus so here these cation and the anions are which are already dissolved into the particular solution now here AgCl which is precipitated crystal so those precipitated crystal which is a dynamic equilibrium with a cation silver cation and a chloride anion of a dissolved solution okay now based on the like a chemical kinetic equation now K equilibrium is equal to concentration of a product that is Ag plus into Cl minus by the like a concentration of AgCl. So simply this is the reaction. That is the simplest representation of a, like a AgCl. Okay. Now here, so before going to the like a AgCl reaction. Now uh, from the like uh, from the activity reaction. So now here K equilibrium is equal to AAg plus plus AcL minus AAg plus AcL minus. Now let us assume that here the solution to be ideal. So let us assume the solution is ideal. So it is the ideal solution. So in case of ideal solution, activities is equal to the concentration. In case of ideal solution, activities is equal to the concentrations. Activities are equal to the concentration. That's why so K is equal to like a concentration of Ag plus 
and the concentration of Cl minus. Concentration of Cl minus. Now here, uh, in before that, here AgCl solid concentration is also there. That is activity is also there. So the activity or concentration of uh, solid forms uh, which are equal to the unity. Let us assume here it is the like AgCl concentration. AgCl concentration. Now here the solid concentration and pure gases concentration is equal to the unity. That's why here K is equal to Ag plus and Cl minus. So this is called a KSP. So the KSP is equal to Ag plus concentration into Cl minus concentration. That is called as a KSP. That is nothing but a solubility product. Solubility product. A simple reaction. Very easier reaction. Okay. Now let us uh, represent the uh, general representation of this uh, solubility product. So, which is uh, already discussed in our ionic equilibrium classes. Okay. Now, here it is the like a uh, general representation. It is a salt uh, that is AXBY salt. So, which is uh, decomposed as A and B. So, that means uh, here AX, uh, that means X number of A atoms are present and Y number of B atoms are present. Y number of uh, B atoms are present. We are already uh, observed in the like a crisscross method. So, the charge of the cation which is nothing but uh, quite opposite so this is the plus y this is the minus x okay now here it is the salt dissociated like this so let us the in, in, let us take any example like agcl is there so ag ag plus and cl minus that means here it is only one so here only one so that's why x is equal to one y is equal to one so plus y plus y is equal to one uh, minus y well, minus x x is equal to one now let us go through the like ag2 so4 okay now here ag here x is equal to two x is equal to 2 so4 here minus 2 top of the molecule is 2 so now let us assume that here x like a ag plus so4 ag plus so4 now here x is equal to 2 2 ag now the plus y y value is 1 that's why plus 1 okay now so4 so4 here the number of moles of so4 is 1 that is y so here y is equal to 1 now again the uh, charge of the so4 is nothing but a minus x so minus x is equal to 2 so minus 2 so this is the simplest uh, uh, like a uh, representation now let us assume the agcl3 so here also like a uh, 3 moles of agcl3 ag plus 3cl minus ag plus 3cl minus that is the simplest representation of salt which is dissolved into the particular solution okay now here it having the solubility product so that is that is, is nothing but a ksp now here in the in particular ksp so which are involved in the like a solubility of a and solubility of b solubility of a and solubility of b okay so here are which is also represented in solubility yes only okay now here the solubility of a which is nothing but x here also solubility of a which is nothing but so which is related to the y which is related to the y now let us substitute those values in our general equation ksp is equal to x yes now here the concentration of power is nothing but x here also concentration of y yes power y okay now let us substitute those values x power x and s power x now into y power y and s power y s power y now let us keep uh, keep right side of the like x power x and y power y so these two are the variable values these two are the like a uh, uh, real numbers so now here s power x into s power y now here the bases are equal then powers are equal the powers are summed that is a uh, uh, like it is uh, x power x into y power y into s power x plus y so this is equal to the ksp this is equal to the ksp so now ksp general representation is equal to x power x into y power y into s power x plus y okay now let us take the some of the examples uh, for our our practice okay now here several types of reactions are there now like a uh, ab type of reactions here x is equal to 1 y is equal to 1 now then the ksp is equal to 1 power 1 into 1 power 1 into s power 1 plus 1 that is equal to the s square now in this case of ab so ksp is equal to s square okay now here a b 2 or a 2 b so now these values are changed so here in this case x is equal to 2 y is equal sorry x is equal to 1 y is equal to 2 now the bottom case uh, x is equal to 2 y is equal to 1 whatever the uh, whatever the uh, values x is equal to sorry x is equal to 2 y is equal to 1 okay now in this case uh, the ksp value is equal to like a uh, 1 power 1 2 power 2 into s power 1 plus 2 so that is 1 power 1 1 2 power 2 4 1 into 4 4 s power 1 plus 2 is 3 4 s cube so the ksp of a b 2 or a 2 b type is equal to 
for SQ. Now let us assume, so another type A to B2, now here X is equal to 2, Y is equal to 2. So now in this case, KSP is equal to 2 power 2 into 2 power 2 into S power 2 plus 2. S power 2 plus 2, that is the simplest representation. Now 2 power 2 is equal to 4, 2 power 2 is equal to 4, S power 2 plus 2 is equal to 4. 4 4 is 16, 16 S power 4, 16 S power 4, that is the A to B2 type. Now AB3 type, that is the simplest example is our MG, ALCL3, okay. Now KSP is equal to 1 power 1 into 3 power 3 into like S power 1 plus 3, S power 1 plus 3. Now here it is 9 into like sorry 27 into S power 4. So this is the KSP. So many of the JE means and the neat table questions, uh, they are susceptible these type of questions only. Okay. So if you refer the previous year uh, JE means and neat papers, uh, definitely you will observe the, uh, you will find, uh, find out uh, these type of uh, problem solutions. Okay. Now here it is the basic concept of solubility product. Now let us go through the, our like uh, electrochemical treatment. Before going to the electrochemical treatment, uh, how many, uh, how it is worked on the solubility product. Now let us go through that. Okay. So this is the basic, basic part, no doubt. Now let's go through the like uh, another of like another level of solubility product. Okay, now let's go through the uh, whether the like a uh, precipitation and the solubility product uh, top, uh, terms. Okay, now here it is the like a solution. Now again, uh, it is also another solution. Now here also another type of solution. Okay, three vessels. Now here, so if it is possible uh, in uh, in the starting of video we have discussed uh, like up to tenth spoon it is uh, uh, dissolved. It dissolved. Those type of uh, up to tenth spoon is nothing but uh, it is called the unsaturated solution. If possibility for the like some more addition, some more addition of a solute particle, those are unsaturated. So if you cannot uh, possible uh, like uh, some more addition product, uh, if it is uh, still it is completed, that is uh, that is nothing but a saturated solution. So if it is added to the, uh, additionally added to the excess of amount of, uh, excess of amount which is added to the saturated solution, now here it is precipitation takes place. So this is our like a solubility of, like it is precipitation, okay. Now whether it is precipitation or not, okay. Now here in this case unsaturated compound completely dissolved, completely dissolved. Now we observed like Ag plus and Cl minus type of ions, Ag plus and Cl minus of ions. So now here saturated solution it is uh, uh, neutralized. So now here in this case of uh, like uh, additional amount of solute which is added to the saturated solution. So now here Ag plus and Cl minus is absorbed. Again uh, Ag Cl salt is also uh, formed. So the time of Ag Cl salt and Ag plus and Cl minus is present. Now we absorb the solubility product term. Which case we absorb the solubility product. So whenever saturated solution which is added to the some amount of uh, which is added by the some amount of solute particles, some amount of salt solute particles. Okay. Now here unsaturated compounds here only like dissolved ions are present. So that's why in case of unsaturated solutions we absorb ionic product. We absorb the ionic product. That here it is the ionic product is nothing but uh, so the concentration of ions. Okay. Now it is if it is possible I'll make the another video on the like ionic strength of the uh, electrochemical cells. Okay. Now here three. Cases are arise. So ionic product is greater than that of the KSP. Now what will happen? So in case of ionic product is less than that of the KSP. Now what will happen? So in case of ionic product which is equal to the KSP. Now what will happen? So if ionic product, this is the best method to predicting the like whether it is precipitated or not. Okay. Somehow sometimes it is difficult to uh, find out the whether it is precipitated or not. Okay. But uh, in the form in the with the help of uh, solubility product, uh, we are uh, definitely predicted whether it is precipitated or not. Okay. Now let us go through the like first point. Ionic product is greater than the KSP, then precipitation is occurred. So precipitation will occur. Will occurs. Okay. Now again, so if IP that is ionic product which is less than that of the K KSP, so then no precipitate. PPT is nothing but a precipitate. Now if IP is equal to the KSP, here the ionic ionic solutions and uh, like a KSP uh, solubility product both are equal, then it is nothing but a saturated solution. So then it is nothing but a saturated solution. So these three points absorbed in our like uh, general terminology of the, uh, the solubility product. Now let us uh, apply the electrochem electrochemical treatment on our solubility product. Now let us go through the electrochemical treatment.
Okay, now let us apply the electrochemical treatment on our solubility product. Now here it is electrochemical treatment. Electrochemical treatment. Simply, now we will go through the like a simple reaction. Now here it is the like a galvanic cell which is connected through a salt bridge. Now here it is anode. This is the cathode, so which are these two are connected to a digital voltmeter. Okay, now here it is the like a AZ silver metal is there. Here also like a AZCL is there. So both are AZCL but different concentration. If different concentration of a uh, single type of electrolyte is present, those type of uh, cells are called electrolyte concentration cells. If it is possible, next videos in the, like after the EMF application, we will upload the like electrolyte concentration cell videos. So here it is nothing but electrolyte concentration cells. Here both are the same solution, but the concentrations are different. Okay. Now here it is the silver and the metal. Metal. Here both these both the sides are also metal is same. Okay. Both the electrodes are same. Both uh, solutions are same. Uh, solutions are same, but the concentration of solution is different. Those type of so, uh, cells are called electrolyte concentration cells. Electrolyte concentration cell. Now in this in this case we observed some of the reactions. Now here it is the AgCl. So in the presence of AgCl. So here it gains the electrons and it forms the Ag plus Cl minus. Are you clear? So Ag Cl is nothing but Ag plus and Cl minus. Okay. Now here it is the plus positive charge of the any cation which abstract the electron and it forms the neutral. So Ag plus will gain the electron and it forms the neutral. So Cl minus as usually. So this is the simplest reaction. Now here it is the reduction reaction. So reduction reaction always uh, takes place at the cathode or anode. Definitely it is cathode. So at cathode. At a cathode. Now the second step at the anode. What will happen? Now here the in this case here the gaining of electrons takes place. Those gaining of electrons which is lost from the silver metal. So the silver metal which lost the electron and forms the like a, and in, involves the oxidation reaction and it involves the oxidation reaction. Now here oxidation always takes place at anode. Okay. Now the overall reaction is like AgCl. AgCl, Ag is a cancel, electron electron cancel. So will dynamic equilibrium with Ag plus and Cl minus, Ag plus and Cl minus. This is the simplest reaction. Now with the help of like a, our previous concept, so the Ksp is equal to Ag plus concentration into Cl minus concentration by AgCl. So the unit, the solid pure solid concentration is equal to unity. Then Ksp is equal to Ag plus into Cl minus. Ag plus into Cl minus. This is the simplest concept. Simplest concept. Now let us apply in the like a Nernst equation on this particular electrolytic cell. Okay. Now let us apply the Nernst equation. Nernst equation. Okay. We know that the Nernst equation that is E is equal to E naught cell. EMF of the cell is equal to E naught cell minus 0 0.0591 at particularly 25 degree centigrade temperature only N into log of the concentration of product by concentration of reactant. So that is nothing but a reaction coefficient. Reaction coefficient. So these application, so these the cell which is applied from the Nernst equation. Now Nernst equation applied for this cell. So now E cell is equal to E naught cell, E standard cell minus 0 0.0591 upon N into log of so the concentration of product is nothing but a Ag plus concentration and Cl minus concentration by the AgCl. Okay, now we know that the value of AgCl is equal to the unity. That's why log Ag plus and Cl minus is observed. Log Ag plus and Cl minus is observed. Now E is equal to E naught cell minus 0 0.0591 upon N into log of Ag plus and Cl minus. Simply it is called as Ksp. At what at the what time it is called as a C AGCL? Now let us substitute those values after some time. So Ag plus under Cl minus concentration. Ag plus under Cl minus concentration. Simply it is the Nernst equation. Okay. Now here at equilibrium position. So here it is. It follows the like a dynamic equilibrium at a, uh, dynamic equilibrium position. Now at the dynamic equilibrium, so the both the solution that means uh, solutions and so, so, saturated uh, like a salt uh, saturated solution which is dissolved by the some amount of the ions. Now which is a dynamic equilibrium with a uh, salt particle, so salt particles. So at the time, 
So at equilibrium, E is equal to 0. EMF of the cell is equal to 0. Now at the time, KSP is equal to AG plus under CL minus concentration. We know that. At the equilibrium position, KSP is equal to AG plus into CL minus. Now here, at the equilibrium is equal to KSP into, KSP is equal to AG plus under CL minus. Now let us substitute these values over the above equation. Now here, E is equal to E naught cell minus 0 0.0591 upon N into log of like a KSP log KSP. So here KSP is nothing but a solubility product. So here KSP is nothing but a solubility product. So sorry, here E is equal to 0. E is equal to 0. Now let us, so E naught cell is equal to 0 0.0591 upon N into log of KSP log of KSP. So this is the like a solubility product equation. This is the like a solubility product equation. So it is very important reaction. It is very important formula for the uh, like uh, our cells. So E naught cell is equal to 0 0.0591 upon N into log KSP. In this case, only one electron is transferred. So N is equal to 1. Simply it is E naught cell is equal to 0 0.0591 into log KSP. Log KSP. Now again, so we will go through the some other like uh, difficulties on these problems. Now here E naught cell is equal to E cathode minus E anode. So E cathode, ca at the cathode reduction takes place, at the anode oxidation takes place, at the anode oxidation takes place. So this is the E naught cell, E naught cell is equal to E naught cathode minus uh, E naught uh, anode. So at the both, both the cases, uh, both are uh, reduction potential values, then only it is possible. So now if you are, if you have any doubts, uh, please uh, refer to our uh, previous videos. Okay, now E cell is equal to E naught cathode minus E naught uh, anode. Okay, now at cathode, uh, which type of reaction takes place? Now here E naught is equal to AG into like a CL minus into AG CL into AG. Okay, so here it is the metal ion and metal salt. See, simply it is metal. Okay, so metal ion salt metal, metal ion salt metal minus E naught is equal to AG plus AG, AG plus AG. This is the E naught cell reaction. This is the E naught cell reaction. Now let us substitute those values over there. So AG is like it is a CL minus AG CL AG minus E naught into AG plus AG is equal to the 0 0.0591 upon N into log KSP log KSP. Now let us substitute, let us uh, uh, right side, let us uh, move the these value into right side. Now we will get the this type of reaction. Like uh, E naught CL minus AG CL AG is equal to E naught of AG plus AG plus 0 0.0591 upon N into log KSP log KSP. It is very very important problem. So with the help of uh, our uh, like uh, our galvanic cells we will find the KSP formula. Okay. If you know the like E naught cell value directly we will substitute this value uh, this equation. Okay. So without knowing the E naught cell value if they are given in the one of the E cell value. So sometimes the questions might be asked in our, like, uh, our competitive exams. So if they are given in the like uh, reduction potentials of uh, at anode or cathode particularly they are given in only one. Okay. Now find the another one with the help of KSP value or sometimes it, it may be asked so they are given in the, these two values find the KSP value such type of problems are asked in like our competitive exams our competitive exams it is very useful it is very useful topic okay so this is the simple uh, simple uh, representations and formulas for the electrochemical treatment of uh, our solubility product now let us I will give the one of the simplest like a general representation of these type of reactions now I will go through the like a general representation please note it Okay, now the general representation of uh, our uh, like solubility product in electrochemical treatment. Now here it is metal. So metal, uh, metal halide, metal halide which gains the electron and it forms the like uh, metal and the X minus. So those metal will lose the electrons in the bottom reaction. So uh, it forms the metal plus and the electrons. Here n number of electrons, n number of electrons, n number of electrons. Now let us substitute these values in our managed equation. So E naught cell is equal to, E, e cell is equal to, like uh, E naught cell minus 0 0.0591 upon N into like a log of like uh, these equations. So the, the particularly this is nothing but KSP. Okay. Now here E naught cell value and E cell value. E cell is equal to 0 for the equilibrium constant. 0 is equal to E naught. So uh, now I will re rearrange the equation. E naught cell is equal to 0 0.0591 upon N into log KSP. So this is our unknown, uh, known, known equation. Okay. Now E naught cell is equal to. So simply here it is the metal. 
So that is the like a metal always here the first step is reduction it occurs at cathode now the second step is oxidation it occurs at anode it occurs at anode so at cathode reduction reaction takes place at anode like oxidation reaction takes place so first of all e cathode minus e anode is nothing but emfl so at cathode that is nothing but x minus m x into m minus e naught of like a ag like a metal plus into metal so both are reduction values both are gaining the electrons here the representation m plus to m but uh, actually it appears like m into m plus so that's why we will sign it we will change the sign in emf value calculation okay now here here the reduction potential of anode and the reduction potential of cathode which is nothing but emf cell so 0 0.0591 by n into log of kcf okay Yes, please. Now we will uh, like uh, move the, these equation to the right side. Now E naught is equal to x minus m x m is equal to E naught m plus m plus zero point zero five nine one upon n into log k s p. So these are the pretty easier problems uh, for solving the solubility product. Okay. Now let us uh, let us uh, summarize all the problems in uh, our solubility product. Then after I'll solve the sum of the previous year CSCR net and uh, gate problems. Okay. Now here let us summarize all those problems. Okay. Now the first one. So KSP is equal to like a uh, AG plus and Cl minus. Simply the general equation Ksp is equal to M plus and Cl minus. M plus and X minus. Sorry. Okay. Now uh, let us, uh, let us uh, uh, examine yourself. They are giving the Ag2SO4. Then Ksp is equal to Ag plus. Uh, here the power is equal to 2. That means why? Because X is equal to 2. Ag plus 2 into SO4 minus 2. Okay. So this is the Ksp value. Like that. Okay. Now the second that is the like ionic equilibrium Ksp is equal to Ksp is equal to X power X into y power y into s power x plus y okay now here x and y are uh, like a coefficient uh, coefficients of the like our reactant particles now s is the solubility ksp is the solubility product okay now the third equation now here log ksp is equal to in our equation e naught cell is equal to e naught cell is equal to 0 0.0591 upon n into log ksp now the another equation Simply like a E naught cell cathode. Simply it is cathode. Okay, now we know that it is cathode. Or otherwise, like a metal, sorry, halide, metal, like a salt and metal is equal to E naught of like it is metal cation plus metal plus 0 0.0591 upon n into log Ksp. So these are the simple problems. Not only these problems, some of the other problems are used in our like a solubility product. Simply salt is equal to like a like solution is equal to salt plus water we know that okay whenever so salt is added to the water then it is called as a solution so then salt is equal to like a solution minus water salt is equal to solution minus water sometimes they are giving the like solution equilibrium value and the water equilibrium value with the help of solution and the water equilibrium value we can find the like a k salt k salt is equal to k solution minus K water, K solution minus K water. This is also another important formula. Now the sixth formula. So they are given in the like a solubility. So the solubility is nothing but like a K equilibrium, K like a K salt by like equivalent of salt. K salt by equivalent of salt. This is also another important formula which are helpful for the predicting the solubility products. Now the seventh one. Now the seventh one. So if they are given in the like two types of uh, KSP values, so now we use the this type of equation. E naught cell is equal to RT by NF into like a lamb KSP two by KSP one. So if they are given in the two KSP values, two solubility product values, now we use the this type of formula. Okay. Now the final one eighth is equal to now log KSP is equal to sixteen point nine two into N E naught cell. 16.92 into an E naught cell. So these are the pretty easier problems. While you'll observe, you'll watch the video from uh, like uh, starting to ending. So these problems are very easier to remember it. Okay. So after the, with the help of these problems, uh, these formulas, uh, we uh, we can solve the some of the CSCR and gate problems. Okay.
Okay, guys. So now let's solve some of the problems with the help of those formulas only. Okay. Now this is the gate 2015 problem, gate 2004, gate 2003, December CSR net December 2015, CSR net December 2018 problems. Okay. So so many problems are there, but I'll pick out the some of the problems. So uh, due to the like a uh, huge time that is the like video video length is uh, too much. That's why I'll I'll restricted these five problems only. Okay. Now this is the first problem. The solubility product of AGBR they are giving the solubility product so ksp is equal to 5 into 10 to the power minus 13 okay now at 298 kelvins they are giving the another value the standard reduction potential value of the half cell so that is a naught ag agbr like br minus so this value is equal to 0 0.07 volts now they are asking about uh, ag plus ag okay they are giving in the, these two values but find the ag plus ag now we know the formula so here a e naught ag agbr BR minus or it, it may be written as a, like a E naught BR minus AG BR AG okay is equal to the like a E naught AG plus AG plus 0 0.0591 upon N into log KSP okay so this is the problem this is the formula or sometimes here it is the minus which is equal it doesn't matter both are same both are same they are giving these value but they are asking about these value okay they are asking about these value so now log ksp is equal to so this is the log ksp now let us substitute those value here it is 0 0.07 minus e naught ag plus ag is equal to 0 0.0591 so n is equal to 1 why because here only one electron is transferred log of ksp that is nothing but 5 into 10 to the power minus 3 5 into 10 to the power minus 30 okay so so many of the students so many of the uh, the number of like biology students they are suffered how to calculate the log values in case of gate they are given in the ca calculators but uh, csr is uh, this time onwards uh, here they are uh, allowed the gate okay now here in case of csr exams csr exams uh, they are given in the like uh, this type of values now we'll go through the like a simple logarithmic value so so many of the students they are suffered the those log values that's why i'll make the another video on the those logarithmic values okay now let us calculate the log 5 into 10 to the power minus 30 so here it seems to be log ab so log ab is nothing but log a plus log b 10 to the power minus 3 so log a power m is equal to m log a log a power m is equal to m log a now log 5 is equal to 0 0.6990 so here log 10 to the power minus 13 so power is m so m is multiplied that is minus 13 so that is the minus 13 into log 10 so we know that log 10 value is equal to the 1 so here it is the minus 13 plus 0 0.6990 that value is equal to minus 12 point uh, like a 3010 12 point 3010 so let us substitute this value over there now here 0 0.07 minus e naught ag plus eag is equal to 0 0.0591 upon into like a minus 12.3010 so approximately it is equal to the 0 point like a minus 0 0.7269 approximately it is equal to the minus 0 0.7269 e naught ag plus eag 0.07 let us uh, let us keep the, this value to right side and uh, this negative value into left side then 0 0.07 plus 0 0.7269 is equal to e naught ag plus ag so here e naught ag plus ag is equal to 0 0.7969 this is the words okay so this this problem which is nothing but numerical type answer nta type question so they are given the range of answer that is 0 0.792 0 0.82 they are given the this type of range that's why so many of the students they are mistaken at the numerical type answer so, so that's why you go through the concept so it doesn't matter there is no uh, like uh, there is no wrong answer there is no wrong choosing okay so if you go through the concept it is quite easier so this is the first problem now let's go through the another problem so are you clear now let's go through the another problem Okay, now the second problem is the solubility product of AG2SO4. They are given the solubility product. KSP is equal to 1 into 10 to the power minus 5. So if the E0 cell value, they are given the like a E0 AG plus AG. So this is the 0 0.80 volts. The standard reduction potential of the cell. So they are asking about E0 like a AG plus 2, AG2SO4, SO4 minus 2. So this is the equation. It's quite opposite. So in the, in previous case they are asking about uh, like a uh, anode value. Now at the time this time they are asking about cathodic value. Okay. Now let us go through the formula. So E naught AG plus two 
AG2 SO4, SO4 minus 2, which is, is equal to the A naught AG plus AG plus 0 0.0591 upon N into log KSP. Okay, now here E naught value they are given the 0 0.80, 0 0.80 plus 0 0.0591 upon 2. Why? Because here two electrons are used. AG2 SO4, that means two, two AG plus uh, here two electrons are used. Okay, now here log ksp is equal to sp nothing but 10 to the power minus 5 so it seems to be log a power m okay now here 0 0.80 plus 0 0.0591 upon 2 into minus 5 so here it is approximately 0 0.0591 into 5 that is equal to the 5 5 <coughs> 29 like 0 0.29 double 5 so here it is equal to 0 0.80 minus 0 0.29 double 5 by 2 so here 0 0.80 minus 0 0.1477 approximately 77 okay now here the value 0 0.80 0 0.14 so approximately here it is equal to the like 0 0.65 0. Point, uh, almost all 652 something okay if they are given the value whether it is right or wrong okay so if they are given in the value 0 0.15 volts 0 0.22 volts 0 0.65 so almost all very close okay 0 0.652 something they are uh, we are getting this 0 0.6533 something okay so they are given the 0 0.65 so this is the correct answer very pretty easier questions while you go through the concept it is a very easier question now let's go through the another problem Okay, now the from the data AgCl plus A electron gaining, so now it forms the Ag plus a Cl minus, which is a, a, like a directly given in our uh, like a topic question. So the solubility product of AgCl, they are asking about the solubility product. So here like a solubility product. Now here it is a, like a E naught cell, like a cathode Ag AgCl Cl minus minus E, e naught cell of Ag plus Ag. Here it is equal to 0 0.0591 upon n into log the ksp they are asking about ksp okay now here e naught cell of ag ag cl is equal to 0 0.22 minus 0 0.80 0 0.0591 upon n into here only one electron that's why log the ksp okay now here it is approximately is equal to 0 point uh, like 58 so whether it is correct or not so 0 0.58 minus 0 0.58 by 0 0.0591 so approximately it seems to be like 10 times but uh, the log ksp is equal to minus 9.85 something minus 9.85 something so if log so it seems to be log x is equal to y then x is equal to 10 to the power y x is equal to 10 to the power y now the ksp is equal to 10 to the power minus 9.85 so which is equal to the 1.5 into 10 to the power minus 10 so this is the logarithmic value so 1.5 into 10 to the power minus 10 so if there is the if the answer is there or not so for the first option so 1.5 into 10 to the power minus 10 so this is the first uh, first option regarding to the our question so pretty easier question all are the easier question now let's go through the like fourth problem <coughs> sorry okay now the fourth problem so they are given in the like a cl to cl minus value 1.35 so here they are given in the another value so ksp value also given so they are asking about E corresponding to the electrode of, uh, so here the reduction value, they are given in the like uh, oxidation. Okay, now let's go through the complete equation. So of Cl2, which gains the electron and it forms the Cl minus, this is the reduction potential. Okay, now this is the, like Ag plus can converts into, Ag can give rise to Ag plus in electron. Okay, so this is the uh, oxidation value, this is the oxidation value. So here it is the overall reaction, but they are asking about, uh, so here E naught er electrode value of half Cl2, Ag plus E electron gaining and AgCl, that is the metal salt, metal, metal ion, salt electrode. Okay, so now here E naught cell of uh, like a cathode minus E naught cell of anode is equal to the 0 0.0591 upon N into log KSP. Okay, so 0 0.0591. So they are given in the like only one electron again ksp value is equal to log of uh, 10 to the power minus 10 10 to the power minus 10 so here they are given in the like e naught cell value that is a uh, uh, approximately it is a chlo chlorine so here chlorine gaining of electron the cathode value 1.35 minus e naught is equal to anode minus e naught is equal to anode okay now here we will get the value 0 0.0591 so log is equal to minus 10 so this is simply it is equal to the like minus 10 into log 10 so log 10 value is equal to 1 okay so minus 10 into 0 point something so minus 0 0.591 
zero point five nine one. So here it is one point three five minus e naught a naught. So here my one point three five, the negative value will comes to the left side. Then it is positive five nine one. So here the negative value which goes to the right side. Then it is also positive. So easy anodic value, easy anodic value. Now the e e naught anodic side is equal to. 1.35 plus 0.591. So approximately it is equal to the 0.6. 0.6. Now the value is equal to 1.95 volts. 1.95 volts. So 0.75, 1.05, 1.65, 1.95. So, so the fourth option is correct. So the fourth option is correct. It is also very easier problem. Now the final problem which is given in December 2018 CSAR. Okay, now the standard free energy. So now in this time, they are, with the help of solubility product, they are asking about standard free energy value. So AG BR, AG plus and BR minus is closest to two. So the, the delta G value which is closest to the, which uh, which type of, like which of the following option. Okay, now here, delta G is equal to minus NF E cell, minus NF E naught cell. So without, without the E naught cell, we cannot predict the delta G value. That's why E naught cell value, E anode minus E cathode, sorry, E cathode minus E anode. So they are given in the like E anode and the cathode value. So simply this is the cathode 0 0.07, 0 0.07 minus the anode value is nothing but 0 0.80. Okay. Now here it is approximately z minus 0 0.73, 0 0.73 volts. Now let us substitute those values. Minus n here only one electron, one into 96,500 into minus 0 0.73 volts. Okay, so quite it is approximately is equal to the 70,044 minus into minus plus, that's why here it is the positive value. So 445 joules and mole inverse. Joules and mole inverse. So here the Faraday value, coulombs and mole inverse. And now here it is calculated. So now we will get the approximately 70.445 kilojoules mole inverse. So approximately is equal to the like 70 kilojoules per mole inverse. So among the four options, uh, first one is 7 kilojoules, so not answer, so not our answer. Second one is uh, 70 joules, it is also not our answer. C is 70 kilojoules, this is our answer. So D is uh, 7 joules, uh, this is also not our answer. So that's all for this video. It is very helpful for the, like uh, those, uh, like uh, uh, JE mains and uh, CSAR students. So uh, please follow the video from starting to ending. So you'll get the definite marks from the electrochemistry. Thank you so much for watching.